Leeds International School Primary 3 First term Buddhism The lesson is Rajumala End of this lesson you will be able to understand who was Rajumala what happened to her how Lord Buddha helped her and Buddha's kindness. Contents Rajumala Her house lady How she met Lord Buddha and how she attained Sota Panna. Dear children, do you know the Lord Buddha has helped so many people in this world? Now I am going to tell you a story about Lord Buddha's kindness. This is the story of Rajumala. There was an innocent girl called Mala. She lived in Uruvel estate at Gaya. She has no father and mother. She was a servant in one Brahmin's house. Mala had long hair and she was very beautiful. The daughter-in-law of the Brahmin was very unkind and weak. She was very bad to Rajumala and she does not like Rajumala. Mala was very sad because the lady hit Mala by holding Mala's long hair. Every day she hits Mala. Mala was feeling sad because the lady hit Mala by holding Mala's long hair. Mala was unhappy because of the lady of the house treated her unkindly. Must I tell you what you should do? You should do the housework. I need not tell you all the time, the lady shouted. Mala could not bear this treatment of holding her by the hair. She loved her hair, but she was thinking of herself as there must be nobody so unhappy like me in the whole of Uruvela Janapada. Mala thought, my lady does not have beautiful hair. She must be not happy about my hair. Maybe she feels jealous of my hair. That's why she holds my hair to hit me, thought Mala. Mala decided to cut her hair. So she went to the barber, got her hair cut. Next day too, the lady wanted to hit Mala. But she was surprised because Mala's long hair was no more. The house lady shouted, Oh, so you cut hair because I pull you by the hair? Then she tied a long rope around Mala's neck and used to pull it when hitting Mala. Because she had a long rope around her neck, she was known as Rajumala. This hurt Mala's neck because she had a rope around the neck. Her mind was sad because she was born as a slave and she felt attempting suicide. I do not like to live any longer. Dying is better than living for me, she thought. She is very unkind to me. I will never be able to escape from her, 
it's all because i was born as a slave i do not like to live any longer dying is better than living for me i know it is bad to kill myself but how can i live with this bad lady thinking so she took a pot and went to forest to suicide herself all of sudden she heard somebody speaking in a very kind note dear child rajumala what are you going to do you are trying to die it is very difficult to be born as a human being so to destroy that life is a foolish act stop my dear child Rajumala turned around to see who it was. She saw the Buddha. The Buddha talked with Rajumala. Buddha was very kind. He preached the Dhamma to get rid of the unhappiness of Rajumala. She understood the real meaning of life. She attained Sota Panna. Rajumala also intelligence to understand the Dhamma. May all beings be happy and well even my lady. May she be well and happy. She said so with much loving and kindness. She filled the pot with water and went back to her house where she worked as a slave. The master of the house saw that there was a great change in Rajumala. Then he told to his daughter-in-law, "There is something new in Rajumala." She looked happy. What happened to her? I just cannot imagine why. Master asked from Rajumala, "Rajumala, you seem to be very happy. You have changed. What's the reason?" "Sir, I met the Buddha. He preached the Dhamma. I listened to the Dhamma." She replied, I am a Buddhist. I have developed metta. I won't get angry with anyone who hurts me. The master asked the daughter-in-law of the house not to ill-treat her. And the master was happy at the change of Rajumala. The Brahmani invited the Buddha and offered alms to the Buddha. Buddha preached Dhamma to them. The master and the daughter-in-law listened to the Dhamma preaching. The lady became a kind person. She never ill-treated Rajumala thereafter. She became a good person. We have not treated Rajumala well. We hurt her. We have committed wrong. They felt shamed of themselves for the way they treated Rajumala. After that, they treated Rajumala like their own daughter. The lady became a kind person. She never ill-treated Rajumala thereafter. The lady of the house cut off the rope around her neck and presented her a necklace and beautiful clothes. Rajumala was saved by the Buddha. The Buddha's kindness to Rajumala that changed her life. 
this helped to gain kindness out of the master and the lady of the house. Rajumala thereafter spent a happy life with much faith in the Dhamma. Not only to Rajumala, when somebody needs Buddha's help, he went near them. He helped Sunita, Sopaka, Angulimala, Patachara and Kisagotami also, when they need Buddha's help. So, in this lesson we learned to be born as a human being is a very rare chance. So we should protect our life, we should collect more merits. Preach the Buddha. Exercises After do this lesson, you have to find answers to these questions. First one. Who was Rajumala? Second one, what did the Buddha teach Rajumala? And what happened to Rajumala later in life? Thank you for listening children.